<laughs> I see it. Are you guys ready? Dude, it's beautiful. Dude, I don't know anybody with a supercar in Japan. Wait, actually, I know one person. Who? This guy. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> I can't tell if I'm an idiot or not, bro. I just freaking bought a Ferrari. You know what? I'm not an idiot. You know why? Because I got a Ferrari. What kind of idiot has a Ferrari? Tell me that. <laughs> Never heard of an idiot with a Ferrari before. Damn, bro. I'm just crazy. I'm not an idiot. <laughs> Thank you for picking me up, buddy. No problem. We got a little surprise for you guys. I flew back to Japan for a reason. We bought a supercar. And Kino actually drove it here. How was it? Oh, it was so much fun. It sounds amazing. Really? Yeah. Yeah, when you hit the gas pedal, bro, the vibration on the car. Yeah. Is it crazy? Yeah, it's crazy. It's unreal. All right, guys, it's time. I bought my first supercar, and it's here in Japan. I hope you guys are excited, because I am. Let's go check it out. Yeah! <laughs> I'm fucking hyped, yo. It's only been a week, but how I've missed you. Dude, we need one of these back at home. I don't drink coffee back at home. I only drink coffee in Japan. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I see it. Are you guys ready? Oh, fuck. Kino. I gotta tell you one thing. Uh huh. Can you scratch the back? Uh huh. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, I thought you were serious. I was gonna say, it's okay. Dude. It's beautiful. Are you guys ready? Here it is, the new supercar. <laughs> Liberty Walk 360. Yes, I know it looks really high right now, but Kino aired it all the way up. There you go. Oh, thank you, bro. Guys, I'm officially a Ferrari owner. Yo, dude! You probably know this already, but uh, the exhaust it has a valve. Oh, there's a valve on it? I didn't know that. Oh, really? So uh, this controller, it opens a valve. <gasps> Dude, no way. So like when you see a cop, just close it on the freeway, open it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. You know what? Dude, I don't even know what to say. I'm just like so like speechless right now. This is going to stay in Japan for the next year because this is a 1999 and it's not US legal yet. That's crazy to say, huh? That I got a Ferrari to know, keep right? in Japan and drive around. I think my favorite part of this car has to be the rear end. And this is aired up all the way. That's insane that it still looks that good. Oh my God. That's freaking crazy. Kino, I got a Ferrari, guys. Do we have a problem? We did not think this far ahead. Uh, Kino came to pick me up and uh, this doesn't fit in the car anymore. The car has air suspension. So the frunk is all taken. My backpack fits in there, but this does not fit. What do we do, Kino? Worst comes to worst, I could take the train. No, 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 no. Hell no. We got to drive the Rari, bro. We'll make it work. Make sure it's a neutral. You guys ready? First start. Woo! All right, windows, windows. Where, where are the, oh, there it is. Window switches are on here. Oh, it's loud.
Ah, this is insane. We got a Rari, baby. Uh, so what do we do now? I'm, I'm like so in shock. I don't even know what to do. <laughs> let's, like, go, let's go for a drive. Yeah, let's on the freeway. No, let's figure out how to get that in here oh, first. Oh yeah, that's true. Whoa, I don't know what to do, bro. I've never had a supercar before. Ah. There you go. Oh, carbon Kevlar. Dude, these seats are sick. <laughs> Dude, I'm like literally geeking out right now. It is what it is. I gotta sit a little close, but we're good. <laughs> this is crazy. High school Randy would never think that this would ever even be possible. I <sighs> just want to say shout out to all the haters that said that I wouldn't make it. I did this because of you guys. Kino and I are hungry. Let's go grab some food. Let's go. And let's go on our first drive. I am so blessed to be here right now, to be able to fly to Japan anytime I want, to have a supercar that's going to stay in Japan. That is like the biggest, biggest flex ever. And it's all because I have such a great community supporting me. And I get to go hang out with Kino. Let's go get some uh, yakiniku. Let's go eat which is barbecue. Let's go. Check this out. Even though this car is left-hand drive, there's one thing. JDM. JDM forever, <laughs> baby. <laughs> What in the 1970s is this air controller? This is crazy. <laughs> this is some old air technology. Holy crap. Bag riders, if you're watching this, we're going to need to upgrade the management system in this. Airx has got to go. I'm so glad that we're sponsored by bag riders. We're going to probably need a whole kit for this. We're going to upgrade everything. Oh, do we have Bluetooth? No, we don't. I don't even know what those switches are down there. But all I know is... We've got a gated six speed. Okay, hazards are right there just in case. Let's see what this is. That's for the frunk and that's for the uh, gas cap. All right guys, I think this is a safe ride height for me. We can't be driving around aired up. Are you guys ready for the first drive? Let's go. Dude, I'm so scared, Kino. Like, it's so scary driving this car because I don't want to break it. And I don't know what it's going to take for it to scrape yet, you know? I think this is the most expensive car I've ever bought. <laughs> oh! Oh! I you scraped it. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> and you can hear it still. Traction control kicked in. <laughs> this thing has traction control. <laughs> wow. I can't believe I bought this car, bro. This is unreal, bro. Too much right? Yep. All right. control kicked in. The tires are spinning. Oh. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm in Japan with a Ferrari, baby. <laughs> Life's crazy. I'm literally just smiling the whole time. Damn, I hope you guys are smiling too. This is crazy. It's been a long journey. Me and YouTube, we're like this now, bro. Like YouTube doesn't feel like work anymore. This just feels like, I don't know. I, I just vlog anything I want to now. I gotta get used to the gated six though. It's it's kind of weird. It is weird. Though. Yeah, it is a little funky. I'm not, I'm not used to it, dude. I don't know anybody with a supercar in Japan. Wait, actually, I know one person. Who? This guy. Ooh. Oh, that was crazy. <laughs> I can literally just like melt right now, dude. I'm kind of sad that we sold the Supra and the Chaser though. Right. But you know, I think it's kind of worth it. Dude, it redlines at 85. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I don't know where traction control is, so I can't turn it off. But when traction control kicks in, it just slows the car down. Kino, Man. I can't tell if I'm an idiot or not, bro. I just freaking bought a Ferrari. <laughs> you know what? I'm not an idiot. 
You know why? Because I got a Ferrari. What kind of idiot has a Ferrari? Tell me that. <laughs> Never heard of an idiot with a Ferrari before. Damn, bro. I'm just crazy. I'm not an idiot. This is <laughs> fucking just crazy. This is fucking nuts, bro. Dude, my heart is going crazy right now. You don't even know. I've never had this feeling buying a car. I moved from S chassis to my very first supercar. It's like a different, it's a completely different feeling. And also I'm in Japan. I don't know what I'm doing right now. Like, <laughs> I don't know when to turn right. I don't know when to turn left. I'm just gassing it. There's a light in front of my eyes so I can't change lanes. You know? Let's turn it off. Guys, we have an issue. We have an issue. Uh, so, this Ferrari is way too big to fit in any of these regular parking spots. Look how wide the car is. We're for sure not going to fit. I need to move it over, let's say, six inches. Yeah, that's not going to fit. What do we do? We have reservations right now for barbecue and every single spot is the same size. And look at these drop-offs. They're all the same parking too. I'm so screwed. Why did I buy a white body Ferrari? Trust. Guys, I'm freaking out. Look, look at the right side. Look, look at this, hold on. Look, I'm literally freaking out. Look, I thought I aired out. <laughs> <laughs> what? I only aired out half of it. And look at this. I, oh my fucking God, dude. I have not eaten yet, and driving this car around is so scary. It's stressful, right? And, and I don't know what I press on that freaking old air suspension controller, but like, you know what, let's just go eat first, yeah? I'm starving. Let's go eat. We'll come back and we'll worry about this later. Uh, there, okay, now she's locked. We are here. Tonight's on me, bro. Order all the good stuff. You sure? Yeah. 100 bucks for just a steak. <laughs> Don't order that one. <laughs> order whatever you want. If, if you want that $100 steak, it's cool. You just gotta pay for it. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. While Kino orders some food, let's check out the key. Of course, I had to bring the Eliminate carabiner and this car staying in Japan. So I brought the Japan Eliminate jet tag. That says Japan. Check this out guys, this is literally the exhaust valve remote. Powercraft Japan, hybrid exhaust system. It actually makes a huge difference, huh? Yeah, the valve. I'll show you guys first thing tomorrow, it's so dark, but I think I'm pretty tapped out for the night. We're gonna enjoy some barbecue, and uh, tomorrow when the sun's up, I'll show you guys, because right now the lighting's terrible. Yeah. And driving around with the flash in our eyes, I really couldn't <laughs> see anyways. <laughs> So driving with a Ferrari right now, I'm literally freaking out. And playing with the bags, Oh yeah. I screwed something up. So I gotta figure out how to use the controller. We gotta have a ride height, a high ride height. And uh, I don't know if I'm gonna do a low ride height, but we'll figure that out all tomorrow. Let's enjoy some yakiniku. If you guys didn't know, this is Kino's, I think it's an STI. It is an STI. This thing is beautiful. It's an STI, right, Kino? Yep. Bro, this is literally my favorite car. All I said Kino's missing are some Workmeisters. <laughs> Molded wide body. Like, even the doors. Oh, that's sick, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. Yeah. It's too wide that it, the, the lid doesn't open. Uh -huh. That's smart. Yeah. If you haven't been to Japan yet, I highly recommend going. All the way. My bad, I almost totaled the STI. Keep going. You got it, you good, you good, you good. Woo! What a beast. You're done. All the way, all the way, all the way. Yeah! Sugoi! Kino and I were going to 
going to a car show right now. There's some kinks we gotta work out with the Ferrari. So I hope we can fix that today. We had some issues last night, but uh, I guess. Yeah. Let's just get today started. Let's cross fingers. Yes. Or we're returning this Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, there's no returns. <laughs> another 360 in here and I realized it has a whole completely different interior than me like the center console right there is obviously silver and even the door and the whole trim on this car is slightly different I'll take you guys back to the 360 in a bit to show you my interior but uh it's kind of cool knowing that it's completely different and check this out this thing is so tiny I don't think you guys can tell on camera but let's compare this car <laughs> to this one is this a cappuccino or is it a beat oh it's a beat how cool is that all right guys i think it's finally time it's a new day the sun is out and i figured out how to work the air suspension on this airx is such old technology that i don't understand i'm blessed to have airlift but let's just take a quick second to appreciate how wide this car is oh my god are you ready let's go through this together i spent all of last night driving it around and a little bit of today just learning a little bit more about the car if you guys didn't know this is the liberty walk kit on the 360 we've got some workmeisters and let me take you guys inside and show you guys this interior is completely different from the other 360 if you take a look right here that says galant ab plug exclusive line i don't know i don't know if this is like a full custom interior but it does have carbon fiber all around center console is carbon as well as well as the radio bezel i'm assuming that it's a custom interior because even the bride seats say Galant Abflug. If anybody knows anything about this, please let me know. But let's take a seat together. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, a lot of people don't really like the tan interior. I think I'm a huge, 
huge fan. It's so different from what I'm normally used to and it's it's just nice. Oh yeah, don't don't mind this. But look. Okay, let me read. RDA X Galant Ab Flug is boarding to the next level. If you have a passion for speed, we've got the styling and power you need. Creating the ultimate performance upgrades is our aim. Welcome to Sensory Overload. That's the name of the game. Hmm, I'm assuming that this is a custom interior, but it just makes it that much nicer. Even carbon all here. I'm sure you guys have all watched the auction video before we purchased this car. There was a check engine light and I read all your guys' comments. We do believe that it's just a sensor. The car has great compression, has been well taken care of, and the car drives amazing, no issues. Oh man, this is insane that this is my car. Oh, I didn't get to play around with this, but check it out. Even right here, there's a sport mode traction controls right here I don't know what that is I also don't know what these are right here but this is my car now so we're gonna learn there's one thing I absolutely love about the 360 I don't know how to say it I don't know if it's Modena Modena if anybody can tell me how to say it it would be greatly appreciated you know I just say Modena just because I'm reading it as a regular American but check this out guys one of my favorite things about this car is of course this red key but all right that's obviously with the valves open right here we have a powercraft exhaust I'll show you guys this is what it sounds like with the valves open and here's how it sounds with the valve closed. How nuts is that? Such a huge difference. And if we're gonna bring this car back to California, that is a must. But here in Japan, this thing stays open. But we need to talk on the vlog, so valves are closed. Ah, let's pop this and let's get into the specifics of the 360. Right under here, we've got a 3.6 liter naturally aspirated V8. My first V8 on the channel. It makes 400 horsepower and 275 foot pounds of torque. Oh, there's the exhaust. This is a Powercraft high performance exhaust system. Cool. What do you guys think? This car is definitely my style. We're gonna go through, we're gonna change a few things. We're gonna make this our own and uh, we're gonna have some fun with this build. I hope you guys are excited. All right guys, I think it's time. I gotta go check into my hotel. And honestly, I just wanna enjoy the Ferrari with the camera off. This feeling right now is so magical and I think I'm just gonna enjoy it off camera. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. This is the new Japan supercar. That's crazy that I don't even have a supercar back at home, but I have one in Japan. It is a 1999, so we can't bring it back home just yet. But now I have an excuse to go to Japan anytime. If any of my friends are watching this and you guys wanna go to Japan, hit me up. I'll go literally any chance I can. I do have a Matsuri car here, so I do wanna go drift as much as possible. I think the next time we come back, I'm gonna fly back with Luke because Luke deserves a little Japan trip and we can come back and we can switch this to airlift. So if you guys need to bag your cars or anything, Bag Riders is your place to go. I just wanna say that the hardest thing is keeping this Ferrari a secret. By the time you guys watch this video, just know that I've tried to keep it a secret for as long as I possibly could. I'm driving around Japan and just taking videos and not posting up anything. That's pretty much it guys. Randy with a Ferrari is checking out. See you guys later.